Hey kiddos, let's make that cloud of uh, pillar of clouds like Moses and the children of Israel I had. So I've already got my dries here in my jar. Got some water here. And I have angry Egyptian dogs chasing me. Yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it? So the pillar of cloud at, uh, could have obviously have been a lot larger than this, but this is still really, really cool to watch. So think to yourself, if you're one of those kids with your mom and dad as the Israelites are leaving Egypt, they're being chased by the Egyptians, and you're following this cloud, and you know God's protecting you and directing you along the way with this, what kind of questions would you be asking mom and dad? I don't know. Something to think about, isn't it? Then, the other part of that, we're going to, here, stop that. So, as you've been traveling along, asking mom and dad those questions of what, what, what's going on? Maybe you want to keep a diary of what it would have felt like to do this. But you also maybe feel like, You've got a problem in your life that seems to be chasing you just like those Egyptians were chasing the Israelites. Well, remember to give it over to God and let him cover you with his protection and his blessings. And remember, he protected them and he led them with a cloud, a pillar of clouds, and he'll do the same. He may not do the pillar of clouds for you, but God still loves you and he wants to protect you. So you can take that problem that just seems to be dogging you and chasing you, give it over to God, and remember to trust in him. Be still and know that I am the Lord. All right? Have a good one, kids.